Hello, it's Dean Marie Love on Cupid Scripted. Thank you so much for viewing this video. I have been waiting so impatiently for this new season of The Walking Dead game. It seemed like it's been like years and years since the last one. It hasn't been that long, but it really feels like it. It was just taking them forever to come out with like any real details. And finally, they have dropped an official teaser trailer and I am itching to watch it. So I'm going to watch it first and then I'm going to talk about it. God, it's here, it's here, it's here. Ugh, these lockers are always so gross. care all I saw is Clementine that's all I really wanted to see I wanted to make sure she was still gonna be in this game and she better be a playable character see Telltale's The Walking Dead game is the game that really got me back into caring about games Clementine like right there with Lee is like my favorite video game character you just have watched this character grow up and you know the first season it's all about protecting Clementine. She has such a heartbreaking ending for that first game. I cried, man, it was like faucet. Like well, way more than I cried for the finale in the second game. Second game was sad too. It had this great moments like the return of Kenny. And then I had that crazy showdown between Kenny and Jane in the last episode. So my ending for uh, season two was Clementine by herself. So Kenny ended up dead, unfortunately, but I just couldn't let him kill Jane. And Clementine left Jane because Jane was a dumb bitch who hid the baby and made Kenny think that the baby was dead purposely and resulted in him dying. Sorry, I just got angry remembering all over again. And now I kind of wish I would have let... No, I shouldn't say that. Obviously, this game is set quite some time after that because she looks quite a bit older. I wonder if they're gonna just skip over all those years and not explain what happened because there are so many different endings that everybody got. If there was eight different endings for the last game, there's gonna be eight different beginnings for this one. I don't know. Maybe that's why it took so long for it to come out. As long as it's been worth the wait, which I'm sure it will because Telltale has really disappointed. I think the only Telltale game I haven't played is Minecraft. This is the game I've been waiting for more than anything else from Telltale. More than Wolf Among Us Season 2, which I really do want. More than the second season of Borderlands. I really, really wanted Season 3 of The Walking Dead. And the Michonne game did not count. It was cool, but it didn't count. You know, obviously, the teaser is just a teaser, so it doesn't show us that much. But it did show us that there was a new character. It showed us that Clem is still alive. There's a new character. I, I just wonder what the state of all the other characters is. For the people who left Kenny alive, is he going to appear in this game or are they just nixing all of that? I can't wait until the full trailer comes out. I can't wait for the damn game. Please leave a comment. Let me know what you think, your expectations, and what you thought maybe the last two seasons of uh, The Walking Dead. Um, do you hope that Clem is the main playable character or are you interested to see this new guy? Please subscribe for more videos. So I'm on Instagram now, so you can follow me here. I just made a new Twitter, so you can also follow me here, and I'll keep you up to date on all the new videos that I got coming out. Please and thank you so much for watching. You guys are awesome. This is Dean Marie Love on Keep It Scripted TV. Bye-bye.